This is not about the leak. This is about women's health care. And I think most Americans actually do care. I hate to disappoint conservative Twitter, but I am going to circle back on a number of things. Why does the president support abortion when his own Catholic faith teaches abortion is morally wrong? Well, he believes that it's a woman's right, it's a woman's body, and it's her choice. Georgia Governor Brian Kemp today accused the president and his allies of weaponizing the Justice Department to undermine election integrity. What's the White House reaction to that? I would say uh, if you have such a fear of making it easier and more accessible for people to vote, uh, then I would ask you what you're so afraid of. The former president just um, released a statement saying that uh, the Biden administration must act immediately to end the border nightmare that they have unleashed on our nation. Former President Trump? Yes. We don't take our advice or counsel from former President Trump on immigration policy, which was not only uh, inhumane, but ineffective over the last four years. Most of the criticism is not of leaving Afghanistan. It's the way that he has ordered it to happen by pulling the troops before getting these Americans who are now stranded. Does he have a sense of that? First of all, I think it's irresponsible to say Americans are stranded. They are not. We are committed to bringing Americans who want to come home, home. Wouldn't it be wise for the secretary to get back on the bicycle, so to speak, and come back to work? Or He's at work. He's on paternity leave. Uh, I was on a conference call with him this morning. Back. He's in, he's in the department now, every day. Listen, Emerald, I think what you're getting at here is this question about whether uh, men, parents, uh, women should have paternity and maternity leave, and the answer is absolutely yes. I, I think a lot of people got the vaccine because they were hearing him say, if you get the vaccine, you don't have to wear masks anymore. So, And that continues to be CDC guidance. And you can say that that's going to be the guidance forever. I am not the CDC director. I understand, but people don't care who tells them to wear a mask. If they should the care. House, if Sh it's the White House. Shouldn't the they CDC, care if it's a doctor, a medical saying. expert, or a spokesperson? I think most Americans actually do care. Does the president have a message for local school officials on dealing with these kind of disputes that are already starting to arise? Between, uh, you know, trans girls who are competing and cis girls in a level playing field. I would just say that the president's belief is that uh, trans rights are human rights, and that's why he signed that executive order. Uh, and in terms of the determinations by universities and colleges, I would certainly defer to them. Sorry to see you go. Are you? <laughs> <laughs>